Well guys, October is coming up in a few days, you know what that means. Yes, is a spooky month, which means, Halloween is right around the corner, I can't wait to dress up in costumes and go trick or treating, or probably, go to a Halloween party. That's right Mariana, Halloween is coming up, what are you all gonna dress up as for Halloween? I'm going to dress up as Marinette Dupain Chung, the main protagonist of my favorite TV show, Miraculous. Tales of Lady Duck and Cat Noir, and to go with my costume, I'm also gonna bring my kitty plushie, Marinette and Super to transform into a ladybug. I'm going to dress up as Dipper Pines, the main protagonist of my favorite TV show, Gravity Falls, alongside his twin sister Mabel. And speaking of Mabel, my little sister Delilah is going to dress up as her for Halloween, but I don't know what my little brother Declan is going to dress up as. I'm going to dress up as Tiny Bun, the main protagonist of the Disney Channel animated series, Tiny Bun. I'm going to dress up as Woody from Toy Story, calls on my 7th birthday. I had a Toy Story themed birthday party back in 2017. Since Woody is my favorite character from all the Toy Story movies, I decided to dress up as him this year. I'm going to dress up as Asha, the main protagonist of the Disney 2023 movie. Wish, me and Mattis saw the movie with our family, so I decided that this year, I would dress up as Asha, and I have a Valentino plushie to go with my costume. Valentino is Asha's pet goat. I'm going to dress up as Dash, the oldest son of Mr. and Mrs. Incredible, in Halloween 2018, me and Judith, along with our family dressed up as the entire Incredible family, our dad was Bob Parr, aka, Mr. Incredible, our mom was Helen Parr, aka Elastigirl. Girl, Judith was Violet, I was Dash, and our little brother Messiah was Jack Jack, what about Luna, what are you gonna dress up for Halloween? to do the math homework she assigned to us. She says it is due until tomorrow. I am a hard-working 7th grader, and I have a lot of stuff to do in the 7th grade. Oh, so that explains it. I just got done doing my homework, and you mainly wanna do your homework cause you wanna get a good grade on every assignment you do in school. And by the way, you are very smart, and like you said, you are working very hard in the 7th grade. I'm gonna go check in the rest of the Some of the 
questions I had trouble with, but now, for the rest of my homework, I'm making sure that I complete this assignment all by myself. That's good to hear Gigi, I'm glad you're getting good grades in school, you wanna know something? I went to grade school back in 2013 before you were born in the first grade, I met my best friend Mariana there. Huh? You went to grade school for kindergarten and you were five? Yes, Mariana and I have been best friends ever since we were six years old. Here's the story. Okay Mariana, this is your new classroom. Are you excited to go inside the classroom? Sweetie, what's wrong? Are you a little nervous? Oh baby, mommy knows this is a new place for you. It's better than your old school. I know it wasn't that good. So this is why we moved to Pinksburg City. You could meet new people there. Daddy had to get a new job cause he was tired of his old job. And I know that you will make lots of new friends. Mommy was nervous when she was the new student at her new school too. Try not to feel nervous anymore, okay? Good, now come on, give mommy a goodbye hug. Good morning class. Welcome to your first day of first grade. I bet you all are excited about the 2016 to 2017 school year. And I have great news. We have a new student joining our class. Her name is Mariana Wilson. She is the same age as all of you guys. She just moved to Pinksport City. Hello there, Mariana. Welcome to your first day of first grade. Why don't you tell the class a little bit about yourself, okay? Hi, my name is Mariana Wilson. I was born on June 29th. 2010, as of right now, I'm six years old like all of you guys. My favorite colors are light green, light pink, and other light colors I like. I hope we can all be friends. Phew, that, that made me feel, feel a lot better, better. and mommy, mommy was, was right. right. I, I would make, make a lot, lot of new friends, friends in my new school. school. Why don't you go take a seat next to Luna? Hi Mariana, I'm Luna Richardson, it's really nice to meet you, I'm so glad you came to this class. My name is Oscar Lopez, it's really a pleasure to meet you Mariana. My name is Judith Anderson, and the boy sitting behind me is my twin brother Mathis, and like I said, we are both twins. It's an honor to meet you Mariana, we can be great friends together. Hello Mariana, my name is Desmond, I'm very happy to meet you. We're glad to have you in our class, Mariana. My name is Starly, and I'm full of styles, and I love singing. Say, um, Luna, I have a question that I haven't asked anyone. Would you like to be my best friend? Of course I would. I've been wanting to have a best friend, and we would do everything together, and I will always be there for you when you need me, and we would always have playdates, sleepovers, etc. Yay! I'm so happy that I have a best friend like you, and I will tell my mommy that I have you as a best friend. We will be best friends forever and ever, no matter what. We stick together. Oh, so that explains it. You and Mariana were best friends ever since you were six years old, and I remember when I first met her when I was a baby. I loved playing with her twin sisters Emma and Ella. Yeah, and we would always have sleepovers, playdates, and other stuff. I remember back in 2017, I had a sleepover at her apartment, at first, I was having fun, but then, I was feeling homesick, and her mother let me talk to mom on the phone, and that made me feel a lot better, and guess what, I still had a good time, and you, mom, dad, and our other siblings came to see me, and that made me feel even more happier to see all of you, Mariana is the best friend any girl could ever ask for, she's my very best friend. So Luna, have you told your little sister Gina the story of how you and Mariana met?
Why yes I have, I told my little sister Gina, of how Mariana came to the first grade class on the first day of first grade back in 2016. That's nice that you told your sister about it Luna, I bet you could tell a whole bunch of stories to us. Yeah, I bet you would bond with Gobi, he creates the best stories ever, and someday, you could both make up and tell your stories. You and Mariana are really good for being best friends, cause you know, best friends always stick together and have each other's back. At first, I was nervous to go in the classroom on the first day of first grade, but when I gave my mom a hug, I felt better, and I felt even better when Luna accepted my offer to be her best friend. We are very happy to have you in the first grade class Mariana, and we all wanted to be your friends. I really love having you guys as my friends, including the Mandy Gang Kids and the Ox Gang Kids, and speaking of the Ox Gang, there are new members joining the gang, and we might get to meet them someday. Sometimes we get into arguments, but in the end, we work things out together. And Stella might tell you guys the story of how she and I met and became friends. And let me tell you, we had lots of fun when we were kids. I even love hanging out with kids that are my age. And I even love hanging out with Mariana and Amir since they live across the hall from my apartment room. I even love hanging out with my best friend Gabby, who is Gil's younger sister. She and her make great friends. And she would always invite me to her birthday parties. And I would invite her to mine too. Having friends is the best. You need friends cause you want someone to hang out with so you are not alone. You make a really good point there Mia. Whenever I feel lonely, I can just call or hang out with my friends. And as I learned in Logo Friends, no matter what, we stick together. 